Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Sarai. E. Thank you so much for being here today. I'm freaking excited for this video. So I quickly wanted to mention that I have partnered up with NARS to bring you guys this beachy, luminous look that I'm just absolutely obsessed with. Like, look at my skin. It's orgasm all over. I am freaking obsessed. We're going to be using these products right here from NARS. But yeah, I just can't wait to show you guys. I'm going to be doing this dewy overall look, aka orgasm all over. This blush right here brings back so many memories. I'm just so freaking excited and I can't wait for you guys to see how I achieved this look right here. And again, I'm just so grateful for these opportunities. None of this would have happened if I didn't have you guys by my side and always supporting me. So thank you guys so much for all this. Um, but anyways, um, if you guys want to learn how to do this orgasm all over look, then please continue watching. All right, so lately what I've been doing is doing my eye makeup first and then um, my face makeup because I feel like if I do my face makeup first, it's gonna sit way longer than my eyes and I want my, you know, I want my face makeup to look as fresh as possible so that's why I'm doing my eyes first. Um, and I actually have been doing that for quite a while and I really like the finished results. So that's what we're gonna do today. Um, for those that are saying, huh, eyes first, how did she start to do the eyes first? So let me show you guys really quick how I prep my eyes. Doesn't matter what concealer you use, And then all I'm gonna do is kind of just prime my lids with the concealer. You guys probably are thinking, is she going to set her eyelids? And yes, I cannot not set my eyelids. I feel like I've I did that one time and all my brushes literally had like concealer in them, like built up concealer. All of my blending brushes, by the way, it was really like, I had to wash them um, right away because then they like gets like really, really hard. So what I do is with any brush, I just set the crease like this. I set it with loose powder. All right, so for today's eyes, I'm going to be using the Narcissist Wanted Eyeshadow Palette. It looks like this. Super beautiful. I love the packaging. So I've heard nothing but good things about this palette. I love how it says, are you a narcissist? It's very cute. I'm going to be taking a blending brush. The first shade that I'm going to be picking up is 7 Heaven. And I'm going to take this color right in the crease. I'm gonna be taking a shadow hill, this color right here. And what I'm gonna do is focus it kind of above the crease. All right, so now that we have something going on on the crease, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this shade right here. I think it's pronounced Delirium. If not, I will put it on the screen. Um, I'm gonna be taking it with my finger and I'm just going to be applying it on my lid since this is a you know um beachy luminous makeup i do want a little pop of eyeshadow right there on my eyelid so now i'm gonna do my face makeup so i already have my skin pre-prepped so what i'm gonna do is apply primers so i'm gonna be taking the nars pore and shine control primer it looks like this and what i'm gonna do is take a little bit of this right here and kind of just apply it everywhere I feel like I applied a little bit too much but it's totally fine wow this is a very different like texture feel to the skin I like it not complaining at all so NARS was kind enough to send me two shades of my favorite all-time absolute favorite foundation which is the NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. 
oh my god i freaking love this foundation i'm so happy they sent me one because honestly mine was already like done like look at this it's already done so um i'm just gonna be taking aruba which is this shade right here i freaking love 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 how perfect of a match this is for me so so i'm gonna be applying my foundation All right, so NARS did send me my favorite shades. Um, you guys know that I love concealing and then highlighting. So they sent me two shades. Um, they sent me my favorite and my only shade that only matches me, which is ginger. I use this one to conceal first. And then to highlight, I use biscuit. So let's go on with ginger first. Let's apply some. And right, now I'm just going to blend it out. Look how nice that just covered. And then I'm just going to blend it out with my sponge. Alright, so now that everything is good and blended, I'm going to go ahead and take my NARS Soft Velvet Loose Powder. Looks like this. I love NARS packaging. It's literally the best. So what I'm going to do is kind of get rid of the creases under my eye. All I'm going to do is take some on the back of my sponge and start to set everything with it. This loose powder is amazing, you guys. I don't think you guys can see on camera, but my skin is flawless. Like, it looks flawless right now. So now I'm going to go ahead and do my bronzer. Um, for today's bronzer, I'm going to be taking the NARS Bali Assess bronzer. Looks like this. It looks amazing. I can't wait to put it on my face, like, now. I'm going to be taking this brush right here, and all I'm going to do... So, you guys are probably like, why did she take her brushes from here? So... What I'm going to do to my room is kind of like remodel my vanity a little bit. I can't wait till everything is done. I kind of want more, more drawers for my makeup because if I showed you guys where I'm keeping my makeup, you guys will be like shook because I need more storage. Um, I do have a lot of Ikea drawers, but I think I want those transparent um, kind of drawers. I don't know if you guys have seen um, Desi Perkins' uh, makeup makeup storage collection she made a video about it and i just fell in love with how she keeps everything so organized and i want something very very similar so i think i'm just going to change everything in my vanity like that's why i have kind of everything very empty so don't worry guys because i am thinking of filming right behind it so you guys will see everything once it's, once it's all done but yeah guys i can't wait to show you guys and it's gonna be pretty good all right so now for blush i so excited because i'm gonna be taking the nars orgasm blush looks like this the packaging is so beautiful it's like a metallic rose gold i freaking love it and this is how the packaging looks like i love the pink lettering and then the orgasm right in the middle of nars i love it um and let me show you guys how the blush looks like so this is how the blush looks like super super beautiful so very short story but nars was actually the first blush that i bought with my own money like how many years ago like five years ago you guys it was such a big deal to me because i never thought i was gonna own something from nars because you know they're very pricey but 
super worth it and I bought this blush um, this was my first blush you guys first high-end blush that I bought which is so crazy now that I'm working with them and it's I never thought that I was gonna be working with NARS like ever I don't know it's just a very very surreal moment for me and I want to you know just throw that out there that anything is possible anything seriously like who would have thought little old me would be partnering up with one of the best brands well I think one of the best brands out there um, in the makeup industry so I really really like I'm so thankful and this was my first blush you guys so now um, we're gonna leave our face alone I'm gonna go ahead and fill in my brows um, I've been doing this for quite a while now and I like how my brows turn out they look a little bit less you know filled in they look more natural so yeah I'm gonna do that off camera and then I'll be right back all right so we're done doing our brows and this is what I mean they look more natural well not super natural but they do look pretty natural to me um, so now I'm just gonna continue doing my eyes I'm gonna be taking the same NARS palette the same narcissist palette and I'm just gonna finish up my look I'm going to be applying more of the shade yeah I think we're pretty much done with the eyes I'm gonna go ahead and apply my highlight so I'm gonna be taking the NARS orgasm illuminating loose powder and it looks like this again the packaging is a one um, is it me or NARS has the best packaging like I feel like I said that 20 times in this video but they do they seriously do I'm gonna be taking some on the back of the little cap and what I'm gonna do is now, oh, yup. So now I'm going to be applying my Lily Lashes in Hollywood. I absolutely love this style. I really do recommend getting this if you like, you know, fluffy lashes. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and fix my hair right now and then I'll be right back to finish up the lip color All right, so now I'm gonna be doing my lip. I'm gonna be using this NARS Precision lip liner. This is in the shade Halong Bay I'm gonna be taking this orgasm after glow lip balm. I'm just gonna apply this right on top before I apply the lipstick I'm going to be applying this NARS whole vinyl lip. It is in the shade Orgasm, so I'm just going to be applying this. Oh my god. That is so pretty. Oh my god. Alright guys, so this is pretty much it for this look. I really feel like this is an orgasm all over look. I freaking love it. We did use the orgasm collection and I'm just super obsessed with how the makeup look turned out. You can honestly wear this anywhere to the beach especially. I would definitely wear this to the beach. But yeah, I freaking loved how it looks. My skin looks luminous. It looks glowy. It just looks like super super pretty so i really loved how the makeup look turned out i hope you guys did too and um if you guys have any questions on the products i will leave them down on my description box so you guys can go ahead and check them out thank you guys so much for watching and i'll catch you guys on my next video bye guys